This is Today with Campbell Brown and Lester Holt, live from Studio 1A in Rockefeller Plaza. Good morning, everyone. Welcome to Today on a Sunday morning. I'm Lester Holt. And I'm Amy Robot. Campbell has the morning off. Happy Easter, everyone. We're back on this Easter Sunday, April 8, 2007, with a winning entry from the 2007 Rube Goldberg Competition. A group from Ferris State University in Michigan built this contraption to squeeze a fresh glass of orange juice. The challenge to make at least 20 steps. Well, they're going to do over 300 before that juice starts flowing. We'll follow the progress and check out the finished product in just a moment. Meantime, welcome back as we're out of the plaza, everyone. Lester Holt, along with Amy Robach, is good enough to fill in for Campbell Brown while she takes a day off. And I guess Easter eggs aren't the only thing hatching this morning. That's right. Apparently, some baby eagles are hatching as well, and that is certainly good news. The once endangered species are making a comeback. In fact, they're laying healthier, stronger eggs, and scientists now want to know why. It's a strange phenomenon, but certainly a welcome one as well. We're going to find out more about that in just a moment. We are also going to check out, try and check out, what's going to happen on The Sopranos. They are into the final episodes now, this long-running series. A lot of people are trying to write their own endings as to what should happen to Tony Soprano. Well, Dominic uh, Kinese, uh, Kianese, who plays, of course, Uncle Junior on the show, is going to stop by, and maybe we can pry some hints out of him as to what's going to happen on the show and certainly get the thoughts of cast members as they... Uh, I guess it's probably a, a, a bittersweet goodbye to the show. I'm sure it is. Years. You think you're going to get him to actually uh, sing? No, we don't, uh, just sing, maybe. <laughs> but, sing like uh, a canary, I mean. Well, now. he does sing. It's funny you should mention <laughs> that. But no, I don't think he'll give us too much, but right. we'll see. You'll die trying, we'll I'm try. sure. <laughs> but first, back to the most creative way we've ever seen. Wow. And loud way we've ever seen to uh, make or pour a glass of orange juice. Tom Sabrandi, James Travis III, Mike Dunnikin, and Matt Tomaszewski have helped to build it. Thanks for being with us. We're going to talk a little bit about this competition you I all guess. entered. Uh, apparently, the, the task is to make a fairly simple task as complex as possible. You all have managed to do that. Tell us what we're looking at. This is our entry for the Rube Goldberg competition this year. Uh, we had chose the Toy Factory theme last year, beat out by Purdue. So uh, this year we decided to go back uh, with a vengeance. Uh, they took the world record last year, so this year we came in with 345 steps, uh, beating out the world record of 125 but you, steps. But you, last only, year. you really only had to do 20 steps exactly. to do this, and there was a certain size limitation. What made you guys decide to go with toys as your as your method? We wanted to do a toy theme because everyone can relate to all the different types of toys we have on here. We have a bunch from all different types and a bunch of different ages on here that everyone can relate to. And we should know you did get a little orange juice squeezed out of here. <laughs> <laughs> How long did it take you to plan this and then to build it? We spent about 3,000 hours planning and building, so this, all together. 3,000 hours uh, did not include any engineering or design time wow. that took place outside of the lab. Wow. So. Well, well we, we certainly appreciate it. Congratulations, Thank and you. not only thanks for being here, but thanks for bringing this whole contraption yeah, and you're setting it up. I know it's cold and probably didn't didn't work as quickly as you would hope, but we appreciate you being here. No Thank word you. on how the orange juice tastes, though. Yeah, we'll, we'll take a sip later on. Guys. We want to go check out the weather now from Janice. 